Titans softball took on Canisius for a second time this season, looking to secure another win against the Golden Griffins after the Titans took the win against the team a week prior in the Titan Classic Tournament. Canisius got off to a slight lead in the top of the first. Jessica Durzen singled to shallow left field and Samantha Galarza wasn't able to grab it, getting to second base. Then, Lindsay Silfer had an RBI single to shallow right field, which allowed Jessica Durzen's to run in and score. Canisius extends their lead in the top of the third. Jessica Burzins hits a triple down left field far and long. She gets all the way to third base. Then Robin Kennery bunts down the first baseline and Jessica Burzin scores. Cal State Fullerton answers. In the bottom of the third, Lisa Harris singles the shortstop and advances to second base after a throwing error. She capitalizes once again on a Griffin throwing error when she advances to third base and then home to score the first run for Cal State Fullerton. Titans keep momentum going when Lisa Harris singles to center field and brings Rippy in to score. Then Eliza Crawford hits a three run home run bringing in Missy Takiaho and Samantha Galarza. Titans now lead 5-2 to two over the Griffins. In the bottom of the fifth, Olivia Martinez grounds out, but Lauren Mario advances to third and she's safe. Paige Kissling then has an RBI single to left field as Lauren Mario scores. Bottom of the sixth, Eliza Crawford walks and bases are loaded. Melissa Seacrest stole the night with her grand slam to left field. She brought in Megan Nastasio, Samantha Galarza, and Missy Takiaho. Titans take the win 10 to 2 over Canisius. I feel like that just like started the energy for everyone. We were all kind of just like under pressure to just do good, but it finally just opened everything up for us. It was great. Um, I was struggling all game, and I just couldn't let it snowball. I took it one pitch at a time, and the runners got on, and I saw it and drove it in. Oh, you know what? I think um, the first half of the game, they were battling, and they had the best of us. And I think um, what they did is they had timely hitting. We took over on the timely hitting. Our pitching, I thought, did uh, outstanding tonight, and we really needed that. We needed that performance going into um, a little bit of a break before we play doubleheader with Bakersfield and then kickoff conference. But I think uh, timely hitting the second half of the game was a difference maker for us. Titans came out with a similar lineup as last week's game against Canisius, and it worked. They got their second win against the Golden Griffins, 10-2. Next, they travel to Bakersfield to play a doubleheader on Wednesday before returning home to open up conference play on Saturday. From Anderson Family Field, Gina Van Stratton, Titan Sports Recap.